On this lovely planet, we have some absolutely amazing natural wonders. Some of these wonders are well known and not too out of the ordinary. However, there are many lesser known wonders that are some of the strangest things you will see on this planet. These are the top 10 strangest natural wonders found on Earth. Number 10, the Cano Cristalis River. When you go see a river, you expect to see a nice blue stream of liquid water. But that is not at all what you get when you go to see the Cano Cristalis River, also known as the River of Five Colors in Colombia. It's bright yellow, red, green, blue, and black streaks that run down the 100 kilometer length of the river are surely one of the strangest things you will see on this Earth. However, once you approach the river and take a much closer look, you will see where the river gets its true colors from. You see, the water in the Keno Cristalis River is not colored at all. The river is actually one of the clearest rivers in the world. What gives the river its colors is the extremely diverse contents of what lays at the bottom. The rocks that are at the bottom of the river are completely covered in flora and fauna. But it's not just any flora and fauna, because this river is located between the Amazon rainforest, the Andes, and eastern Llanos, which makes this river a hub of the most diverse organisms on the planet. And when these organisms gather on the riverbed, they emit a diverse range of colors which gives the river one strange yet beautiful appearance. Number 9, the Bay of Fundy. If you were to go and visit this natural wonder for a few minutes or even an hour, you might actually miss its magic. The Bay of Fundy is located between the provinces of New Brunswick and Nova Scotia in Canada. If you were to go visit the Bay of Fundy and park your boat on the shoreline during the high tide, you might come back to see that your boat is now sitting on a large plot of dry land. That is because the Bay of Fundy is known for having one of the highest tidal ranges in the world. On average, the Bay of Fundy's water level will decrease in height by about 56 feet within a 12 hour period. And it has been known to decrease in height by up to 71 feet on occasion. This extreme tidal range of the Bay of Fundy makes it one of the strangest natural wonders in the world. Number 8, Eternal Flame Falls. Eternal Flame Falls is an extremely strange wonder because it is a flame that has been burning in a cave since its discovery in the 1920s. If that wasn't strange enough, the cave is actually underneath a waterfall that is located near Niagara Falls in New York. So first of all, the cave itself emits a small amount of propane, which is the type of gas that is used in most barbecues. The strange thing is that having a cave emit propane is pretty rare because of its complex molecular structure compared to the much more common natural gas, methane. What is also amazing is that it emits nearly the exact same amount of propane that is needed to run a barbecue 24-7. If it emitted more, the flame could have been out of control. If it had emitted less, the flame would have never been able to ignite in the first place. The combination of having a natural gas cave that has also been ignited, along with it being underneath a waterfall that rarely extinguishes the flame, makes this quite a strange natural wonder. Number 7, Salar de Uyuni. Located in southwest Bolivia, the Salar de Uyuni is one of the largest natural wonders in the world. This gigantic 10,582 square kilometer plot of land is known as being the largest salt flat in the world. However, it is also known as being the world's largest mirror. During the dry season, the Salar de Uyuni is a large salt and lithium reserve that extends as far as the eyes can see. But during the wet season, a portion of the land turns into a lake that is about a foot and a half deep. Because of its shallowness and near-perfect flatness of the new lake bed, this world wonder transforms itself into the world's largest mirror that is adored by photographers from around the world. The combination of all of these features of the Salar de Uyuni makes it one of the strangest natural wonders on this planet. Number 6, the Crystal Cave of Giants. Deep within the Nica Mine in Mexico exists what some call the Crystal Cave of the Giants. It gets its name because of its endless supply of giant crystals that stretch through the entire cave. Some of the crystals have been measured at a length of 50 feet long and have a diameter of over 4 feet. The crystals are largely composed of selenite, but some are made of fluorite, calcite, sphalerite, and galena. However, if you plan on visiting the Nike mine to see these crystals, you may want to think twice. 
That's because this mine is located roughly 1,000 feet below the surface and has an atmosphere that makes it very inhospitable to humans who stayed down there for more than about an hour. In fact, about a decade ago, one man went into the cave with no preparatory gear and died of suffocation from staying too long in the cave. After this event, the mine became closed to the general public, so you may have to wait a little bit before you go see this wonder for yourself. Number 5. Uluru Imagine that you are traveling amongst one of the flattest plains in the entire world, and then all of a sudden you see this 1,132 foot high rock in the middle of nowhere. This rock is called Uluru and is located in the center of Australia. The sudden appearance of a monolith this big that appears in the middle of a geological desert is quite a rarity on this planet. However, it does have a somewhat simple explanation. When two large land masses are crushed together over the course of millions of years, mountain ranges can get created at the center. This is how current mountain ranges like the Himalayas and the Rocky Mountains were able to form. Now, this is also what actually happened to Uluru, except this process happened about 500 million years ago. Then Uluru and the surrounding area turned into a small sea for about 100 million years, which flattened out most of the surrounding area. Then the sea dried up and we were left with a mountain that turned into an island that turned into a red rock in the middle of nowhere. What we were left with was Uluru, which is one of the most sacred places in the entire world. Nature and geology can be pretty strange sometimes. Number 4. Lake Hillier Because of Australia's dynamic geological history, they tend to get some very strange natural wonders, and Lake Hillier is no exception. This bright pink colored lake looks like it is the world's largest source of Pepto-Bismol, but it is actually one of the largest sources of Dunalalia salina, which is a microorganism that gives the lake its pink color. Unlike the other entry on our list, the Cano Cristalis River, the water of Lake Hillier is actually pink, not just the rocks below. If you are thinking of going for a swim in this pink lake, you actually can. Arguably the strangest thing about Lake Hillier is that despite its pink color, the lake itself is completely safe to swim in, as it doesn't contain any out of the ordinary harmful bacteria. But it might be tough to get there in the first place, as there are only six flights that fly over it daily, and there aren't any cheap ways to get to the island unless you pay for a full expedition yourself. Number 3. Spotted Lake This strange natural wonder is located in British Columbia, Canada. Spotted Lake during the cooler months of the year is known for having mild variations in color, but looks like a normal lake for the most part. However, when the summer months kick in, the lake begins to evaporate into a series of over a hundred smaller ponds, each with its own unique color. These ponds are known to change in color from year to year and can become blue, green, orange, red, yellow, brown, or pretty much any other color that you can think of. The reason why this occurs is because Spotted Lake has one of the richest deposits of various minerals of any lake in the world. And depending on where these minerals settle in the summer months, the ponds will have their color dictated according to the corresponding mineral. The Spotted Lake in Canada was purchased by the Okanagan people about a decade ago in order to preserve its ecology. It is currently not available to the public. Number 2. Chocolate Hills Nope, these are not hills that are made out of chocolate, but they are still quite strange. The Chocolate Hills of the Philippines are a series of 300 foot high hills that are spread over an area of about 50 square kilometers. There are approximately 1,776 of these hills in the area, and they are largely made of limestone that is covered in grass. What gives the hills their name is that during the dry season, the grass dries up and the hills turn chocolate brown in color. The Philippines began seeing the Chocolate Hills as a main tourist attraction in the early 2000s, so they decided to build two resorts on the hills in 2006. Since then, tourists have flooded to the area in order to see the endless scenery of the Chocolate Hills. Number 1. Pando in Fish Lake, Utah, there exists a forest. A forest that covers 106 acres of land and consists of a variety of different individual trees and shrubs. Except that isn't true, because this forest is one single organism. That's right. This entire forest is essentially just one giant connection of a single tree that sprouted up from the same root system, meaning that the largest living thing on Earth is not an elephant, it's not a blue whale, and it's not even a giant redwood tree. It is this forest that we call Pando. 
It might not only be the largest thing, it might actually be the oldest living thing as well. This is because scientists estimate that Pando might actually be roughly 80,000 years old. So when you hear the old sayings about how all living things are connected in some way, in the case of Pando, that is actually true. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button to see more awesome videos like this. And make sure to check out our last video, How the Universe is Way Smaller Than You Think. Anyways, thank you very much for watching again, and I will see you in the next video.